Hello and welcome to Hank Games Without Hank. My name is John Green and welcome to the quarterfinals of the EuroLeague. Here we are facing Sevilla in beautiful sunny Spain. Well, it would be sunny, but of course it's dark. We're playing at night. This is a huge game for the Swoodley Poopers. If we can somehow make it to the semifinals of the EuroLeague, it will mean $500,000. That's a whole player for next season. Um, one whole new player just for winning this home and away game. Let me remind you of the rules uh, here in, in the EuroLeague. Away goals are very important. If you score a goal when you are not the home team, i.e. today, that is very valuable because if it happens that like, so it's two games, it's a home game and an away game uh, to decide the, the, who moves on. Well, if the cumulative score from those two games is a tie, the way that tie is sometimes broken is by away goals, which is to say that, um, oh no, I got to tackle from behind. That is a foul. Um, which is to say that if I score here um, and, I, and, and Sevilla also score and we tie 1-1 and then the game in Swindon at the county ground is nil-nil, oh, it has to be, and it is! It is! It is! In the seventh minute, it's ball John Green to other John Green. John Green's John Green's ball to other John Green's. They love each other and they love our team. Yes! Sorry, my voice is still a little cooked from LeakyCon, but that was gorgeous. Oh, it was beautiful. He's big, he's tough, he has a brilliant puff. Other John Green, other John Green. By the way, I want to talk today about uh, some of the songs uh, we have for the Swoodly Poopers. Um, oh, boy. Um, oh, no! Oh, de desperate times. Ricardo Bunsen Berna with a third degree Berna. There's no other way to put it. Oh, boy. He took everything that he knows about chemistry and he put it into that one save. It was gorgeous. Um, right. So, but about away goals. Uh, basically, the key. So, so in that case, if I score, if, it, if, we, if we tie 1-1 here and then it's nil-nil at the county ground, we move on because we scored an away goal, which is considered more valuable than scoring a home goal because home goals are ostensibly easier to score because you have home cooking and whatever, whatever. Um, oh, that, was, that would have been a great time for a certain kind of pass that you didn't make. It's frustrating. That was not obviously where I wanted to pass the ball. Um, come on, come on, come on, come on. Someone was like, it's really frustrating to watch you defend because you just run at players and hit A. And that's, that's true. Is there, I'm, I wasn't aware there was another way to defend. Oh no. Oh boy. So, um, I want to go over all the songs because I feel like uh, we haven't really adequately standardized the system of, of songwriting for Swoodly Poopers. Um, and I want you to, enc I want to encourage you to submit your own, um, own uh, songs about the players uh, that, that, that we can we can sing as supporters. Um, but we have a lot of great ones. I mean, of course, there's there's one size fits all. Um, he's big, he's small, he's also short and tall. One size fits all, one size fits all. A lot of them are the, to that tune. It's a popular, popular soccer tune. Um, but... Uh, um, but I'm also quite quite a big fan of the K Sera Sera... Um, tune which to which Steven Steven Gerrard song uh for Liverpool is that was not a foul if it's a foul to walk up to someone be on equal ground with them want to w share a passion for the ball and to express that passion via knee touching then I'm not interested in continuing to play soccer it's one of my frustrations with the EuroLeague I feel like the the, the uh refereeing could be a little bit better uh, I don't know why I picked today to talk about the songs when I'm so hoarse, but I'm going to keep doing it. So, for instance, we have uh, our central defender, uh, Caceres. Uh, I don't know if you know his song. He doesn't score much, um, but it goes, uh, Que sera, sera. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Yes! He'll never accept a loss. 
He just scored on you like a boss. K sera sera. There's also a Ball John Green song to that tune. It goes, Ball John Green, John Green. He gives it all for the team. Upon his mustache, we're keen. Ball John Green, John Green. That's a personal favorite. Um, of course, when D. McGoldrylock scores, it goes, um, He's big, he's red, he found the perfect bed. D. McGoldrylocks, D. McGoldrylocks. That one, like almost all of these songs were invented by supporters, not by me. Um, oh yeah, when Merrick Merrick scores, selectively mute Merrick Merrick. Of course, the song is just 40 seconds of silence. Um, it's a performance by John Cage. Um, yep, so, so we've got to be totally silent when Merrick Merrick scores. And it's an amazing thing if you've ever been in the county ground when Merrick Merrick scores because the entire ground goes oh it could have been but we needed a little more shkabaga on the ball that's a technical term that's when you kick it hard you get some shkabaga on it um don't run at the players and just hit a but what else can you do and plus it works get their ball john green you're fast enough yes oh i mean the swoodly poopers are just we're just defending like mad it's a beautiful thing to see um but let's face it, we've given up a lot of 90th minute goals in the last. Our our form has not been good, uh, particularly in the league, and there's been a lot of frustration. It's halftime. Um, yes, we're encouraged. We're encouraged. Of course, twice is Vice. Um, his song is "All Right, Stop, Collaborate, and Listen." Vice just scored. No, he ain't missing. It's a rap song based on Vanilla Ice because his name his name is Vice Vice. I don't know. We might be able to do better there. Um, Leroy Williamson, we all know the Leroy Williamson song. I don't even need to sing it, but he does score occasionally. There was been a, there there was a cool Swoodley Poopers chant project in which lots of people recorded themselves uh, singing Leroy Williamson scores occasionally. Uh, since my screeching version of it did not please them, woo! Ricardo Bunsen Burner laid out flat, terrified the striker, and we did not give up a goal. Come on, to oh that was almost right. That was almost right. That's frustrating to see. Yes. Now to other John Green. Now the Y button. No, not there. To the other guy. I think that might have been Merrick Merrick sitting there in the middle getting ready to score. Um, Fahey, our, our central midfielder, doesn't have a song that I know of. K. Fahey. He also doesn't really have a nickname. The guy's never really melded with the rest of the Swoodly Poopers. Um, I don't even know that much about him, to be honest with you. Like He seems like a nice guy. Keeps to himself. You know, smart quiet no doesn't cause me any trouble or anything he's not like stone cold steve with the sea austin but um he's uh yeah i don't hear much from him uh made of win our right back he doesn't have a song yet i'd like him to though um or at least if he does have a song i I don't i don't know it ginger rampage central defender of course his song is ginger rampage ginger rampage ginger rampage has a soul um, that's a good, what? Oh, come on. There was no foul there. This is ridiculous. It, this is typical anti-Swindon refereeing. They don't like us because we're the little team that could, you know, we're not making anybody any money. We're represented by a betting company called 442, not by some multi-international bank. Okay. You see him? Do you see him? Do you see him? No, oh, he couldn't get there. It's frustration for the swoodly poopers. Here we come. Coming forward twice as vice. Going to take the kick. It's a good one. No, it was a good one, though. That was a nice-looking corner. Had some good swing on it. That's not bad. Nope. Uh, if we had a strategy other than um, take it to the corner and um, try to swing it in and across, we would be a better team. But we don't have a strategy other than that. Um, our left back, Escargo, he doesn't really have a song that I know of. I mean, his name is Escargo, though, so that's something. That's pretty great. Oh, that's frustration for the swoodly poopers. Um, who else is even on our team? D Mother Flippin' Fox, um, doesn't have a song that I know of. Oh, oh, yes, he does. When he scores, in the event that he ever scores for the swoodly poopers, um, he, uh, um, it's been agreed that uh, two things have been agreed by supporters. One, I don't know if you guys are familiar with uh, uh, Mr. Hibbert of Everton, but there's this long-standing thing that if uh, Hibbert ever scores, Everton supporters will riot because he's been playing for the club for 11 years in midfield and he's never scored a goal. Um, 
but uh um oh no dog oh, i hate myself it's frustration for the swoodly poopers at least we have the away goal the away goal is vitally important it means that when we get to swindon we can play for the nil nil draw the standard swoodly pooper nil nil draw um Stone Cold Steve with the C Austin has never really had a song either, but again, he's never really needed one. He's not a he's not a tremendous score. Voluptuous Paracard that I know of does not have a song. Um, let's see who else. I'm just passing around, by the way. Uh, we already talked about oh French the Lana song just goes. Um, oh, how does it go? I, it, I I had a pretty good song for him. Um, uh Oh, it goes, uh, it's the, uh, it's to the tune of Poker Face. It goes, uh, la, 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 French la, 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 no. Oh, a supporter came up with that as well. I love that song. Um, he doesn't score much though. Let's face it, almost all of our goals are scored by Ball John Green and other John Green. So they need lots of songs. And the rest, oh, this is, could it be a chance? Could it be a chance? Go to the goal, go to the goal, go to the goal, go to the goal, go to the goal. Pass to your husband. Oh, he tried to get in there, but he was double covered. Oh, I should have gone a little further into the goal. It was a huge chance for the Swoodley Poopers. Sevilla recognizing that they need a second goal in order to have a good chance. They know the county ground is a fortress and that it's very difficult to score there. And so they're desperately trying to find a second goal. And that's opening up things at the back for our standard Swoodley Pooper counterattack. Yes, like that. Like that. Oh, other John Green, you were a little slow on the ball. I'm frustrated with you. To your husband. Yes. Back to your husband. Yes. Oh, it's a save. To your husband. From the edge of the box, it's a terrible shot. Oh, it's devastating. He could have done so much more. It was on his not favored left foot. Technically, probably my fault. Oh, 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 oh. Could it be? Could it be? No. Could it be? Still no. Could it? No. We're going to probably stick with no here. Is that the end of the game? Oh. No, it's not. Okay. Now it's the end of the game. All right. Well, we're going to take the standard 1-1 one, one draw. Uh, upload your video responses. Um, generally, you know, we always like to hear from Swoodley Pooper supporters in the comments and video responses. And let me know what you want me to talk about in the future. Thank you for watching, and as always, best wishes.